Flat screen TV, great buy. Digital picture frame, love it. Computers, a must. We all want those groovy gadgets, but what if everybody had them? The answer, power plants. Dozens of them. Pollution from power plants is linked to global warming. And you know what Al Gore says. Scientific consensus is that we are causing global warming. Now you're asking, how are my gadgets contributing to the problem? The digital picture frame only costs $10 a year on your electric bill. But how much power would be needed if every household had one? Enough energy that uh, five 250 megawatt power plants would produce in a year. Keep in mind that 160,000 homes can be powered by a single plant of this size. Next up, your computer, your laptop, or both. These items only put a small $33 dent in your wallet. But it would take 19 power plants to run two computers for every home in America. Now to that big screen TV. How much more energy will it eat up? Two and a half times as amount of energy that a classic tube uses. Or about 55 bucks a year. But if half the homes in the country were to switch, we'd need 17 power plants just to run those TVs. If every household in America owned a digital photo frame, two computers, and half of them owned a big screen TV, 41 power plants would be needed just to run them all. Running all of those gadgets would account for $85 of your electric bill. So you want to conserve. Just turning off your high-tech equipment isn't enough. Believe it or not, it's still sucking energy. So plug your electronics into a power strip and turn them off completely when you're done. And it's always a good idea to look for the government's Energy Star label. It lets you know when you're buying the most efficient appliances. Now that makes green sense for the environment and your wallet. For more news you can use, go to usnews.com. I'm Chyle Parikh.